Yellowstone is the first ever national park, not just in the States, but in the world. My name is Trinity, and this is Yellowstone National Park. Together with Bani, we will look at geysers, spectacular springs, and we will answer the question... Do you think bison are offended when people call them buffaloes? <laughs> <laughs> My name is Gilberto Molina, Gilbert. Welcome to Yellowstone National Park. This park covers three states, Wyoming, Idaho, and Montana, 2.2 million acres. And as you can see behind us, we have a bison in honor of Trinity. We have named him Trinity just for this moment here. That's awesome. <laughs> There are thousands of geothermal springs in Yellowstone. More than half of the world's geysers and hydrothermal features are located here. Some of them are so enticing, you just want to jump in. But that's probably not a good idea. It's illegal too. geyser comes from an Icelandic word that means one who gushes. Yellowstone is home to approximately 300 to 500 geysers. That's about half of the world's total number. The most famous of them all is Old Faithful, so named because, unlike a good suspense book, this one is highly predictable. In the early days of the park, late 1800s, Old Faithful was used for laundry. Dirty clothes were placed in the crater, and then when the geyser erupted, the clothes were clean. The clothes made of wool got shredded. So we climbed up a nearby hill for a different view of the geyser. As we were waiting, A different geyser erupted. This is the beehive geyser. It shoots water straight up, 200 feet, almost consistently for 5 minutes. That's higher than Old Faithful's average at 145 feet. It's a spectacular show of nature, and it's worth waiting for. Other geysers though? Wait for it. And that's about it. That's it? Yep.
Yellowstone has 290 waterfalls that are at least 15 feet tall. This area can get busy sometimes, but if you're willing to walk, you'll find some quiet spots and you might even get a viewpoint all to yourself. There's all kinds of wildlife in Yellowstone. You will likely see bison, but bears and wolves inhabit the area too. Some animals are just downright lethal. What would you tell people about safety with bison? Safety, you always want to keep at least 25 yards away from them. They are not tame animals. They are not animals that you want to pet because they can be very aggressive. We often get injuries from people who get too close to them and they charge them. Bears and wolves, you want to stay 100 yards away. All the other animals, 25 yards. Do you think bison are offended when people call them buffaloes? <laughs> uh, not at all. The true buffaloes are like the ones in Southeast Asia. But if you call a bison a buffalo, he's not going to be offended and neither am I. But the true name is bison. Okay. So none of them has come up yet to complain? No, no, I have complained yet that I know of. <laughs> All right, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Muy bien, muy bien. Hey. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> 